In this video, we solve the numerical of cow surface submerged in a liquid. So first we understand the problem statement. In the last video, we derived the equation of fx and fy for a cow surface submerged in a liquid. Now problem statement is calculate the horizontal and vertical component of the total force acting on a cow surface AB. So here we see this is the cow surface AB and on this surface the total force is acting and here the total force in a two parts one part is the fx and second one is the fy. So horizontal is fx vertical component is the fy. So we need to find out the fx and fy in this numericals which is in the form of quadrant of a circle. Quadrant of a circle means it is a one fourth part of a circle. So suppose we take here it is a center of the circle. So here we, we are able to draw the one circles. Okay. So this A to B is the one fourth part of the circle which have a radius of 2 meter. Means from O to A is 2 meter, O to B is 2 meter as shown in a figure. Take the width of the gat as a unity. So width of this gat is the unity. Means if we draw this side in a 3D view, Okay, so A, B have a 1 meter weight. So, first we write down the given data. Width of the gat is 1 meter. So, here it is mentioned unity. Unity means it is the 1 meters. Radius of the gat, it is a 2 meter. Radius of the gat means distance O to A and O to B is 2 meter. And this cow surface is below from the free surface. So, distance between the cow surface and the free water surface is the 1.5 meters. And we need to find out the fx and fy. So, first we find out the fx. Now, what is the fx? Horizontal force exerted by water on a gat. Means here we see this fx is the horizontal force. And this horizontal force is acting on the cow surface AB. So, fx is the total pressure force on the projected area of the cow surface AB on vertical plates. So, according to the definition of the total pressure force, the force is acting normal to the plane. And here the force is acting horizontal. So, what is normal to the plane? It is a vertical surface. Okay. And here this vertical surface of the A to B is the OB. Okay. So, it is considered as the projected part of the surface AB. So, total pressure force on the OB. So, what is OB? OB is the projected portion of the AB. So, Fx is equal to rho G A into H bar. So, this equation we already derived in a last video. If you don't know how this equation is come, then I request to watch the last video related to cow surface submerged in a liquid. For that, the link is provided in descriptions as well as in a car. So, we know that the rho means density. Density of the water is 1000. G is 9.8 once. Now, what is the area? So, here we are find out the force on the OB surface. This OB surface is the rectangular portion means it have certain height and the width. Okay, so height OB is the 2 meter and width is given that is a 1 meter. So, 2 into 1, the area is the 2 meter squares. Second, we need to find out the H bar. So, H bar is the depth of CG of OB from the free surface. Means, H bar is find out from the free surface. So, here OB is the one rectangle. And what is the center of this rectangle? So, it is a center point. So, suppose the height is 2 meter. And the center is find out by dividing by the 2. So, 2 meter divided by 2 meter. Means, center is at the 1 meter from the surface O. But we need to find out from the free surface of the water. So, O to C distance is the 1.5. So, here it is 1.5 plus this is the OB distance divided by 2. So, H bar is the 2.5. So, 9.81. So, here the simplification are done. That is a 1000 into 2. So, it is mentioned 2000s. And here 2 divided by 2, it is a 1. 1 plus 1.5, it is 2.5. And then we do the multiplication of these three parts, we get the answer of the fx that is the 49050 newtons. Now, 
this fx force is acting at the which point okay so we need to find out this is the height it is called as the h star so find out the h star equation is ig divided by area into h bar plus h bar so here we know the area area is the 2 meter we are don't know the ig now what is the h bar so here h bar we already find out it is the 2.5 so ig is the unknown parameters now what is the ig ig is the moment of inertia of ob about its cg means moment of inertia of the ob about its cg so cg point is the at the center of this height is it a 1 meters so here this equation is applied by considering the rectangle portions okay so when we see the ob from this right side it's look like one rectangles so equation of the ig is different for the different type of the shape that we already discuss in the last few numericals so b of this rectangle is the 1 d of the rectangle is the 2 and here the d cube so it is a 2 raised to 3 power divided by 12 then we get the answer the power of the 2 is 3 means 2 cube so it is the 8 8 divided by 12 then we get this answer that is a 2 by 3 meter raised to 4 is the unit of ig now we putting this value in this equation of the h star that is ig is equal to 2 by 3 area is 2 h bar is 2.5 plus h bar 2.5 then we get the answer of the h star it's the 2.63 meter from free surface so we already know that h star is always below to the h bar so what is our h bar h bar is the 2.5 and h star is the 2.633 from the free meter of the surface so our answer is correct according to this theory now we find out the vertical force fy exerted by water is given by this equation so fy is the weight fx is the total pressure force and fy is the weight of water supported by ab up to the free surface means that is a certain weight is acting on this cow surface ab okay so how much weight is acting so up to the free surface so weight of the portion d is d a b o c okay so this much water are there so we need to find out this volume okay so here this total area is divided in two part one this is the rectangular portion that is d a o c and second is the cow portion a o b so we divide in two part that is the weight of the d a o c this is the rectangular part and this is the cow part that is a a o b a so it is the cow parts so weight is the rho g into the volume okay so we take the rho g common from this both the equation so rho g in bracket volume of d a o c plus volume of a o b now what is the volume of d a o c so this is the height it is a 1.5 means d a into a o into its weight means 1.5 into 2 into 1 1 is the weight okay so this da into ao is the area area into its weight so we are able to find out the volume so rho is 1000 g is 9.81 volume is ad into ao into its weight that is a one is given so we already write down this one now volume of this portion so here the equation is pi by 4 into radius square that is a ao square into weight is 1 now suppose you are confusing by using this equation just we need to find out the area of the circle that is a pi by 4 into d square okay and this is the quadrant portion so pi by 4 d square is divided by 4 then we are also able to find out this area of aob now we putting this value of the ad that is a 1.5 ao is 2 and this ao is 2 here and we are able to find out the equation by using these calculators so fi is equal to 60249.1 newtons so by using the simple equations we are able to find out the fx and fy so thank you for watching this video if you learn something then like the video and subscribe my channels for watching the more video related to fmhm and other subject of 
mechanical engineering for fmhm subject various link is provided in descriptions as well as in car for other subject i request to visit the playlist